Yo, what's up guys, it is Saints fan. welcome back to another episode of Monday Mailbox. This is a series where you guys ask me questions and I give you guys some answers and my opinions on some things. If you want to ask a question for next week's episode, let me know in the comment section. And real quick, before I get into the questions, I just want to say, like, I am going to be getting back into all the series I do, Monday Mailbox, Fashion Friday, the Squad Cast, we haven't done that in a couple weeks. It's just been crazy the past, like, two weeks or so, but we are going to get back into it, especially with PC and Heist right around the corner. So hopefully you guys are excited. I, I really cannot wait for PC to come out, and I hope you guys can't wait either. But anyway... Getting right into the first question, we have Darren, and he says, what is your favorite thing from the heist trailer? So basically, like, what am I most looking forward to with the heist update? And I don't know, this is a good question. Actually, you guys let me know what you are most excited for in the comment section. But honestly, I'm not sure. I mean, obviously, the, like, there's the Hydra. That's going to be amazing. I'm really looking forward to that. The Hunter, you know, that's going to be really cool as well. All the new vehicles they're adding, those are going to be sweet. But I don't know if those are, like, my favorite thing. Honestly, and this might be kind of lame, but just, like, heist overall. Like, just, it's going to be a fun way to play the game. I think that's what I'm most looking forward to. Because, I don't know about you guys, but... Obviously, I've been playing GTA since it came out, which was over a year ago, and, you know, after a while, some stuff gets kind of repetitive, gets kind of boring, so that's what I'm most excited for, like, just to have fun in GTA again, so, even though it's not really a specific thing, that's kind of, um, that's kind of what I'm looking forward to, but, I mean, yeah, I mean, like, all the guns, all the cars, all the new stuff, it's gonna be amazing, but let me know your, your most favorite thing, or what you're looking forward to the most from the heist update in the comment section. But anyway, moving on into the next question, we have Rossi Plays, and he says, What is your favorite DLC to date? This is a good question. Um, I think I've said it before, but my two most favorite DLCs are the High Life and the Hipster update. And in my opinion, the High Life is a little bit better than the Hipster, just because it has my two favorite cars. It has the Zentorno, and it had the Masacro. So that's why, and obviously, like, the all the outfits and stuff that came with it, the guns were cool in that update as well. You know, I think that was probably one of the best updates or DLCs. I mean, obviously, everybody else has their own opinions, and you guys are more than welcome to let me know in the comment section your opinions, but I think the highlight for me is my favorite. Moving to the next question, we have Jacob, and he says, Are you getting GTA for PC, and will you be doing videos on mods? So, obviously, I've said it before, you guys know, I, mean, I am getting it on PC, and uh, the reason I picked this question is to talk a little bit about my plans for PC and for mods. Because right when PC comes out, there's not going to be that many mods. There might be, like, the first week, there might be some little mods, maybe some graphical ones, or some things, like, uh, I saw on a forum the other day, it was like, when you actually are out in the middle of nowhere and you shoot a gun that has a silencer on it, the cops don't get on you. So it might be little mods like that, that come out the first, like, week or two. And yeah, I am going to be covering them. I'm not sure. Um, I, I might be doing some sort of series. That's what my plan is. I got to think actually about that and, and like the best way of going about it. But I am definitely going to be covering mods. You know, one, like installing them. Because I'm, I'm sure a lot of people, you know, are going to be having trouble with that. And then two, obviously playing them and having fun, especially with friends uh, on the mods. Besides mods, not really sure what else I'm going to be doing on PC. I mean, obviously I'm going to be playing the game on PC. Most of my friends are going to be getting it on PC as well and, and are going to be playing it mainly on PC. So I think that's going to be like my console, or not console, my, my uh, platform of choice for heist and just for other stuff. So, you know, obviously you'll be seeing a lot of PC gameplay, especially in the beautiful 4K resolution, hopefully. But, um, but yeah, definitely mods are going to be coming to my channel. So if you guys are excited, definitely uh, subscribe if you haven't already. For that and sort of going off that question monica asks what are you most excited to see when gta pc comes out and what things are you hoping for the most for pc honestly the thing i'm most excited for pc is just to play the game in one more than 30 frames per second and then two hopefully like 4k resolution or a higher resolution because y'all know and i've said this in the past you know when when ps4 and xbox one like the trailers and stuff came out i was making such a huge deal about like just the little things like the the blades of grass and the foliage and the water on the ground like little things like that and that'll only look even better on the pc so you know that i think that's what i'm most excited for at least in in short term and then like what i'm hoping for a bunch of mods obviously i mean the servers, that's like one of the big things I've said in the past, like I'm, I'm really hoping that we can do some sort of like custom servers so we can have like, I guess more fun in the game. 
but obviously, you know, that's up to Rockstar, but, um, but yeah, either way, it definitely is going to be a good time on PC, but I guess we'll have to wait and see in, t in two weeks when it does come out. And then moving on into the last question, not really a GTA question, but uh, I figured I'd put it in here just to give you guys a little preview of what's to come, and Rise O'Neill says, what new games do you think you'll cover this year? So this month, actually, this week, H1Z1 comes out, not sure how many of you guys are looking forward to that or even know what that is, but it's another zombie game, and it looks pretty neat, and I'm definitely going to be trying that out. Obviously, GTA PC, but also, when GTA PC comes out on the 27th, there's also Dying Light, which looks pretty interesting, I'll, I'll probably give it a shot, as well as Call of Duty Zombies, I think, and even though I haven't really played too much of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, you know, zombies are awesome, so I, I definitely got to check that out. I mean, another big one game is The Division. No idea when that's coming out. Um, some other ones, we got Star Wars Battlefront, which I am super pumped for, even though that probably, or that might not come out until like way later at the end of this year. But I think those are like the, the main ones. I don't know what other games are coming out this year, but those are the ones, at least in the, the near future, or somewhat in the near future. But, uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode of Monday Mailbox. I'm glad to be back. Like I said, if you guys have a question for next week's episode, let me know in the comment section. Anyway, hope you guys did enjoy. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe for more awesome GTA content. And as always, it's your boy Saints fam. I'm out. Peace.